हेलो एवरी वन आई एम शाहन लाइक एंड टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट ट्यूबर कुलोसिस ट्यूबर कुलोसिस इज ऑल्सो नोन एज कॉच डिजीज कॉच डिजीज रिमेम्बर द साइंटिस्ट नेम कॉच डिजीज ट्यूबर कुलोसिस इज ऑल्सो नोन एज कॉच डिजीज एंड इट स्प्रेड बाई ड्रॉपलेट्स ड्रॉपलेट इन्फेक्शन रिमेम्बर दिस वर्ड ड्रॉपलेट इन्फेक्शन Droplet infection. It spread by tuberculosis. Spread by droplet infection. Mycobacterium tuberculosis is the bacteria. Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Mycobacterium tuberculosis is the bacteria for the tuberculosis. Responsible for tuberculosis. And it is acid fast bacteria. Remember this ba- bacteria. it is acid fast why this acid fast the acid fastness is due to mycolic acid the acid fastness is due to mycolic acid we confirm the presence uh, of having the uh, the patient is having tuberculosis by a test known as montex test montex test montex test m a n mantex or montex whatever you call it Mantex test is actually the test for tuberculosis but remember it gives false positive test when there is a typical mycobacteria so montex test is positive when it is false it is falsely positive in a typical mycobacteria and falsely negative in sarcoidosis and hodgkin and falsely negative in sarcoidosis and hodgkin now suppose this is a lung uh, pardon me because i cannot draw a proper lung so this is a lung and this is the base of the lung and in the base you remember the ventilation is maximum and also the uh, the ventilation is generally and pneumo is uh, is also maximum here but b by p ratio that is the sorry p for perfusion and p for perfusion so ventilation and perfusion both are maximum in the base ventilation and perfusion are both maximum at the base but in case of apex the b by p ratio ventilation to perfusion ratio is maximum in the apex ventilation to perfusion ratio ratio ventilation to perfusion ratio is maximum in the apex but ventilation and perfusion both are maximum in the base remember this point another important point which we should be discussing is ghon complex ghon complex is the characteristics complex ghon complex G H O N Ghon complex is the characteristic complex for tuberculosis. It is sub pleural lesion. Remember this sub pleural. So it is below the pleural with draining lymphatics, and this drains. This drains lymphatics. Okay, sub pleural lesion with draining lymphatics. So what does uh, Ranke's complex contains? Another complex is known as Ranke's complex. so when the ghon complex has fibrosed so ghon complex has turned into fibrosed and calcified calcified and fibrosed ghon is known as ranki so what is ranki ranki is actually ghon but it has been fibrosed and along with it it has been calcified remember this terminology next is types the first one is primary tb primary tuberculosis and this is previously unexpected and unsensitized individual so it is occurring in previously previously unexposed individual and unsensitized individual so it is occurring first time so the primary uh, primary tb and you can see the ghon focus you can see ghon focus sometimes this ghon focus from there it will spread hematogenously hematogenous spread and so then it is the terminology is given is simons focus and ranke's complex simons focus for hematogenous spread 
and rank is complex i told you the fibrosed corn and calcified corn is known as rank is complex next secondary tb so what is secondary tb secondary tb previously sensitized host the host which has already been sensitized which has already uh, tb has occurred in that person but uh, after some time it has undergo a reaction of latent so it has undergo latent phase and then again the tb has come back so it is secondary that is previously sensitized host reaction of latent we can find out after many years you can see when this occurs after many years of primary infection and you can see a feature that is very important in secondary tb and that is cavitation and erosion in airway cavitation cavitation is important feature of secondary tb cavitation cavity formation and erosion of airway and the airway is eroded erosion of airway remember this secondary tb feature cavitation and erosion in airway now let us learn this one that is ppt progressive pulmonary tb so what is progressive pulmonary tb progressive pulmonary tb ppt it is immuno compromised and immuno suppressed individual so this progressive pulmonary tb is a pulmonary that occurs in the lungs and progressive it progress with time and that is why it is known as progressive pulmonary tb and it occurs generally why it progress because it occurs in immuno compromised and immuno suppressed individuals suppose in aids patients okay immuno compromised patient you can find progressive pulmonary tb erosion of bronchial artery and hemoptosis and a classical feature of progressive pulmonary tb ppt is erosion of bronchial artery erosion of bronchial artery and hemoptosis hemoptosis okay so you can see coughing and getting out of sputum which is blood colored blood stain because erosion of bronchial artery next is miliary tb so what is miliary tb miliary tb the name because the it looks like millet grain small spots that can be found in the cxr chest x ray of the lungs why because the organism has spread by lymphatics and blood hematogenous spread has occur the organism has been spread to the other organs and it has spread to liver it has spread to lungs sorry it has spread to liver spleen bone marrow adrenal gland meninges and kidney so spread to liver spleen bone marrow adrenal gland meninges and kidney so all these places it has been spread through hematogenous way that is the miliary tb so then we can call miliary tb small remember this uh, name small yellowish white consolidated lesion small yellowish white consolidated lesion thank you for watching this video with me please subscribe our channel for getting more videos like this we want to help medical and nursing students in uh, studies please join us you can join our instagram uh, at the rate sahan medical videos you can also join our telegram at the rate sahan medical videos and youtube channel sahan like and also you can follow us in our facebook page that is sahan medical videos thank you for watching please subscribe our channel if anyone get any help from this video